coming into this game against the Bills in week seven, we already know it's gonna be a very tough opponent in the division. We gotta be able to get some wins. All I know is the fact that Tredevious White is not guarding me because he's guarding probably Devontae Parker or something, I'm gonna be open a good amount of times. It's gonna be it's gonna be dependent on if Mac Jones can make the throws. First and 10, they're in the zone, and I'm running a comeback on this play, but I'm not going to come all the way down on the comeback because he's sitting there. So I'm going to sit in between the zones. He throws me the ball. And that's a good little 30-yard catch. On third and goal, I wanted a fade route to the back of the end zone, but I was locked up, so Juju was open on the slant. Touchdown. Down 10 to 7, and we know this is going to be a real competitive game that we're going to have to score in. But Matt Jones throws the ball to Chadavis White, and of course, it gets picked off. You can't do that. Now we're down 17 to 7, and one thing I wish Matt Jones could do is throw the ball over the cornerback. Like, I have a step on him. He's got to lead it to the outside and loft it a little bit. Don't throw a bullet every time. One thing I realized we really haven't been doing this game that we really should do more of is run the ball. Because obviously, we try to pass the ball, they're probably going to lock us up. If we run the ball, Stevenson can get a good amount of yards. We tried to start running the ball a little bit, but they've been locking it up. With third and 10, and Matt Jones finds Devontae Parker open on the sideline for a first down. It's second goal. All he has to do is throw this fade route correctly, and I would have caught the touchdown. He threw it too far to the outside, out of bounds, bro. On third and goal, since passing hasn't been working in the red zone, we tried to run the ball, but them DTs, they was on that shit. We got to settle for a field goal. Third quarter, it's a seven-point game, and we're trying a little jet sweep, but I didn't get the block I needed. That one lineman was on that as soon as they hiked the ball. Then second and 14, we're trying to receive a screen, and for some reason, Matt Jones can never do this right. He just underthrows it. Even with pressure, you still should be able to get the ball to me. It's a receiver screen. And then again, on third and 14, I get a step on his cornerback, beat him. All he has to do is put enough power into it. I guess, I guess he just ain't got enough throw power because I was burning his ass. All right, man, so we really can't score in this game right now anymore. We're, we're down 24 to 10 now, and I'm getting this first down. We got we to gotta get a drive in, a good drive. This corner finally decides to press me. I kill him off the press, and Matt Jones just, man, yo, this quarterback is terrible. At this point, we're just running out of options. We want a play that we normally don't run. Nobody really got open. Mac Jones gets sacked. What a divisional game. We lose 31 to 10. And I kind of, I basically, I had a pretty good game. Five catches, 92 yards. It's not too bad. No touch though. And honestly, I'm going to just say, we lost this game because of how mid Mac Jones played. Like 53%, you got to be closer to 60. All right, y'all. It's week eight. We're playing against the Dolphins. It's back-to-back -back tough matchups. Last time we played the Dolphins, it was bad. See what happens this time. Now with the Dolphins having the DB core that they have, we're gonna have to run the ball in this game. And if we can't run the ball, we'll get whooped just like we did against the Bills. Though we need the run to work very well in this game, we still need Matt Jones to deliver dots like this throughout the game. We can't have him throwing picks and being dumb. But then again, like I said about the DB core, they're just so good. I tried to beat J Ram on the end route and I just couldn't. Matt Jones ended up getting sacked for a big loss. It really seems like anything I try to do, J-Ram is just shadowing. He's literally running the routes for me, and Mac Jones gets sacked again. Now we're out of field goal range. Still down 7-0 to zero on 30 inches. We're trying to run the ball, but J-Ram makes a big tackle preventing the first down. I, should, I, I was supposed to block his ass. First and 10, trying to run the comeback route, but like I said, this nigga is on my ass, and Mac Jones gets sacked. Then on third and 17, I'm running a streak, and I probably, I got a little step on him. If he just would have put this ball correctly, I would have probably caught it, but he threw it out of bounds. I mean, right now, we really cannot catch a break. Our old line didn't stop blocking and everything, just getting sacked, getting locked up. It's a terrible game right now. On third down, they're in a zone, and if he just would have threw the ball to me to the sideline, I probably would have caught it, but instead he held the ball and got sacked again. First and 10, we're trying to jet sweep. Last time we tried the last game, that did not work. But this time we're trying to run. I tried to get past him, but I could not get around him. I don't have a catch yet in this game, but then we run an RPO. He throws me the ball. I finally get my first catch. Juke Jalen Ramsey ass out, getting the first down. Finally, we got something going. J-Ram hasn't been guarding me all game, and finally they're in the zone, and he's not guarding me, so I get the crossing route, getting the first down. Got two catches now. We're losing 10 to 0, so we gotta put some points on the ball. Running the ball, getting an easy touchdown. Defense did their job. They only allowed a field goal, so we're still in this game. But Matt Jones threw the ball to me on a comeback route. He did not have to throw. There was a zone under me and a zone on top of me. You could have threw it to somebody else. 
Well, now at this point, we're down multiple scores and we're trying to force the ball down the field and it's just not working. Matt Jones gets sacked. We ended up losing our second game to the Dolphins this season, 19 to seven. I was only able to get two catches for 40 yards and two rushing yards this game. And our passing offense has to improve. This is terrible. Only 116 yards with a pick and no touchdown. We gotta do better. All right, so now coming into week nine, we're playing against the Washington Commanders. They have one win this season. We better not lose to them. Now y'all know, for us to be able to win games, our run game has to be at least decent. The Commanders have a pretty good D-line, so we'll, we'll see how this ends up going. With them boys having De'Aaron Payne on the inside, running stretch plays in this game will be amazing. As Stevenson just gets to the outside, breaks a tackle, that was a great run. We need more of that. We're building up a pretty decent drive for our first drive of the game, and Hunter Henry catches his ball in the flats. He gets tackled, and he goes down with an injury. That's our starting tight end getting injured. That's not good. Third and eight, and really, Matt Jones could have threw me his ball off the cut, but instead he scrambles to the left side of the field and just throws the ball out of bounds. Defense did good in getting a stop, but we are all the way backed up, so at this point, all we can do is run the ball, and they see it, but we're getting a good amount of yards, third and seven now. Now that we're no longer backed up against the end zone, we could pass the ball on third and seven. Matt Jones tried to throw a comeback route, but he inaccurately throws it, so it's fourth, we gotta punt the ball. The stretch plays has really been working for us, and Stevenson gets to the outside, gets the first down, breaks the tackle, and they lucky that they had more teammates over there, because he would've been gone. Second and six, and on this crossing route, I get open at the end of it, but Sweat gets there too fast and gets a sack on Mac Jones. If we can get some blocks, we can easily get some yards, and on third and 13, we finally get a good amount of blocks, and I get open, getting the first down and more, trying to juke them out, but it was too many defenders over there. Second down, and Mac Jones throws this dot to the receiver, getting the first down, now we're first and goal. Too close to doing any pads and plays, an easy run in for Stevens. I don't know who this cornerback is, but on third down, he was locking my shit up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Matt Jones ended up getting sacked. We gotta punt the ball. Good defense by the defense. We're still up 10 to three, and I catch this drag route trying to get the first down. Too many defenders in my way, second and three. Again, with Matt Jones not putting the ball over the cornerback, I gotta step on him, and he just, he throws bullets every time. It was a high throw, but it's a bullet. Throw a lot. It's third and three. I'm running the corner route, top of route, and I beat him, obviously, on this route. I could have had a touchdown, probably, but he threw it to the other side of the field, and it was deflected. That's fourth down. We kind of been stepping away from the run a little bit, but we finally getting back to it, and Stevenson breaks off this huge run. Amazing blocks by us. It's first and goal, I'm running an out route, and all he had to do was put this ball perfectly to the back of the end zone, but I guess it's kind of hard to do. It got swatted. When you got a running back like Stevenson, when you're in the red zone, you might as well just get to running the ball. The old line pushed him forward into the touchdown, giving us the lead. They end up scoring, so it's a tie game, and the coach drew up this amazing play. They got Devontae Parker wide open for an easy touchdown. I don't know what they was doing. Great play. Great defensive stop. Now all we gotta do is run the ball, and the game's over. We finally win another game. We win 24 to 17. I didn't have too much yards this game, though. Three catches, 42 yards, still won the game. Matt Jones ain't really had too much yards, but hey, Stevenson was really carrying us this game. Angle, I'm starting to fall off. I gotta lock back in.